हे यू टू फैमिली आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल वेलकम बैक टू अवर डेली हैकिंग न्यूज सीरीज इज द लाइक बटन टू गिव अ शॉर्ट आउट टू अवर टीम नाउ लेट्स गेट राइट इन टू वीडियो सो फर्स्ट न्यूज इज रिलेटेड टू रसिया एंड यू एस सो बेसिकली द यूनाइटेड स्टेट ऑन फ्राइडे ऑफर्स रिवार्ड टू एंड अप टू फिफ्टीन मिलियन यू एस डॉलर फॉर इन्फॉर्मेशन ऑन द रसियन बेस्ड कॉन्टीन्यू रैनसम वेल ग्रुप विच हैज बीन ब्लेम्ड फॉर साइबर एक्सट्रॉसन अटैक्स वर्ल्ड वाइड एंड स्टेट डिपार्टमेंट स्पोर्स मैन एन ई डी प्राइज सेट So basically, the FBI estimated that more than 1,000 victims of the Contin Group have paid a total in excess of 150 million US dollar in ransomware payment, and this was the price which was said in a statement. So, uh, do you know why basically the US is uh, offering this kind of amount for the people those who are going to count out the information related to Contin ransomware? Just comment it down, and I'll give you a small briefing on it. some uh, maybe us is upgrading of it now next news is related to open sea so open sea which is the basically the primary marketplace for buyers and sellers for nft or we, you can say non fungible token so this has been reported major problem with the discord support channel so this is you can uh, say like how major so well there's a potential vulnerability which allows a spam bot to post phishing links to other users which is a problem that leads open sea support to declare please do not click any link in the discord so right now nft is trending and this kind of vulnerability this kind of thing is is going to spread a lot then the people will be in, in very big trouble now next news is related to a ransomware so basically in an interesting turn of event a researcher has found exploit in most common ransomware threat So ransomware families such as Lockbit, Revil, Conti, and Black Basta have bugs, which if exploited, then it prevents them from encrypting any file. So the the researchers named Hyperlink, uh, where uh, hyper is uh, is uh, equals to three, that you can see on the screen. So basically, the researchers from Hyperlinks claim that all the malware samples are exported to DLL hijacking. which is a method used to inject malicious code into a genuine app and the bug could be exploited to stop file encryption so this is you now the last news is also related to a ransomware and this is related to vhd ransomware so basically the experts from trellix discovered that vhd ransomware was linked to north korean cyber army so basically the cyber army of north korea has been divided into several units all of which have different tasks and uh, report to bureau or lab 121 so basically the unit 180 also known as apg 38 is res- responsible for the attack on foreign finance system including banks and cryptocurrency exchange so this is used so do you know what is the full form b h d so just comment down and uh, most probably there is something for you there may be some sort of gift for you so that's all I hope you found this video helpful. If yes, comment down your feedback. Subscribe our YouTube channel because we are bringing hacking news on daily basis. So at last, thanks for watching this video. Have a great day. Jai Hind.